Okay, Nat, first of all, uh, let's talk about your extension to your contract. Another year here at East End Park, you must be delighted to get that over the line. Yeah, I'm just um, glad for it that it's all done and dusted now and already looking forward to next season. Has it been something that's been in the works for the past couple of weeks? Yeah, obviously it took a, a few weeks, but like I said, glad it's, uh, it's over and done with now. And it's been a, a terrific season for you. Slow to sort of get into the team and, and, and find your place, but the past sort of you know six months you've been a, a mainstay, you must be delighted. Yeah, like you say, it was um, a difficult start for me. You know, I took my time, but once I got um, into the team and got running games, it's it's gone well. It was. Uh, I think you you got married last summer, and that was sort of delayed your start of your pre-season. Do you think that was probably the, the factor, and you, you took a bit to get going? Yeah, maybe. Um, I was um, a bit behind, but you know, some things you got to do away from football as well. In terms of the season as a whole, we're, we're going to finish hopefully fifth. We've got a, a big game against Queen of the South at the weekend. How do you feel the season has gone as a team? Um, I guess it's been good. Obviously, it could have been better. Uh, aimed at the start of the season, we to get into that top four. And I think if you look at the past six months, you can see that we're we're one of the top teams in the league. Um, I think uh, too many draws um, hasn't helped, and obviously we didn't have um, a great start to the season. And finally, looking ahead to next year, that's you all sorted and tied up. And what's the aims for next season then? Obviously, um, I'm sure it's just to, to get in the top four minimum, I think, and maybe push on even better. Um, I'm sure if we can keep most of the squad together, we'll be um, in and around the top.